the war that currently rages in Ukraine has brought unspeakable devastation to millions of lives. As artists and humanitarians, the Goodness Tour team arrived in Poland with a multi-pronged mission to bring our art and music therapies in service of the refugees and their children, as well as those who remain in Ukraine. To facilitate this, artist Benjamin Suarez created two community murals inside of Ukraine. The first in Moshun, where 85% of the town was destroyed. Benjamin slept in a bomb building and took suggestions from the community to create a mural symbolizing families reuniting safely with their loved ones. The black um, only touches the surface at the beginning and then it is revealed where the bullets have hit the brick and uh, the mortar and some of the brick falls off as I paint. Uh, this is um, alchemy transforming these bullet holes. The stork, a very important symbol for the village, symbolizes birth and prosperity while the hands of faith hold the nest of their homecoming. This mural honors the hope, resilience, and love of all Ukrainians. In Lviv, he worked tirelessly along with 45 Ukrainian volunteers to create a mural that emphasizes a peaceful sunrise of a new day after the oppressor's attempt to steal the Ukrainian wheat production. This painting speaks of freedom, peace, and a renewed vitality of the land. I am very thankful for this day you and these people because these people inspired me on something global and on something uh, powerful. While Ben was accomplishing this mission, the rest of the Goodness Tour team, Luke, Amanda, Safia, and Jeremiah, conducted art therapy sessions with over a hundred Ukrainian refugee children. Here we are. We got the crew, we got equipment. We're about to walk in right now, first day. What we've been doing in the classroom is creating a feeling of, of normalcy being happy, being joyful, being together. You just realize how much underneath, uh, how much pain they've all gone through. After six days in Ukraine, Benjamin returns to Poland and jumps right into the creation of an epic mural with many of the kids from the program, alongside Amanda, Jagnagna, and legendary Polish muralist, Mikolaj Reis. Art can change the world and we should spread it all over the world to make a better place to live for everyone. This intercultural mural represents the gratitude of the Ukrainian people for the amazing hospitality from the Polish and the promise of their peaceful return back to their homeland. We celebrated the end of our mission with a community concert in Krakow with music from Luke and the Lovingtons. a traditional Ukrainian folk group, Korali, and kids from the program. The birthday is not and only one. Oh, happy day, oh happy day, oh happy, happy day. Happy day, oh happy day, oh happy, happy day. It was a beautiful night celebration of the joy and freedom that can flow when we unleash the artists inside all of us. <laughs> Utilizing music, dance, art, and film. We have shared tears, but mostly smiles, laughter, and joy. And this is the power of art. Its unparalleled ability to bring a child or an adult into the moment and a space of total empowerment and well-being. Amidst the worst of circumstances, it provides a path to reclaim inner power, to feel human again. Today we are literally painting our future, uh, our children that are not afraid of Russian bullets and uh, Russian shells that uh, change it into art. 
Uh, my name's Arseni, uh, and I'm from Ukraine, <laughs> and I like music. <laughs> we will continue to do our jobs to amplify the voices of the Ukrainian people by providing tools of creativity for them to work with and to heal. If you are inspired to support the continuation of this work, please visit us at thegoodnesstour.org.